next log that I will open, at least try to, is this uh, here half cylinder. What's interesting about it is this tail piece, piece on the back is the size of the lock itself. And it's a six pin dimple lock. Very interesting about this lock is that this is used for hotel safes. Basically, you insert the cylinder like that, you turn your key, you hold the whole cylinder, maybe the other way, yeah. and then that's how you lock the door. And yeah, that's how you walk away with the key, and the lock is fully inserted inside the safe. Um, I don't know about the brand of the lock, as you can see the logo on the bar uh, or the brand has been cut away here. No idea why, maybe it was on purpose so that it's not known. Seems to be like a standard keyway, uh, but also from the key itself, I don't know, I have no idea what's the brand because JMA is a producer that makes uh, blank keys as replacement. That's the bidding, quite okay. <clears throat> and having said that, let's have a look if I can, I would be able to pick this lock for you guys. So for myself, I did manage to pick it once only and there's been a little pest afterwards. So, starting from the back, pin number 6, nothing, 5, nothing, 4, and 3, nothing, 2, maybe, yes, 2, gave a click, one, nothing, two, nothing, three, four, no, four. Mm, nothing really, let's try five and six again. Seriously, what's with this ant? Guess they also like to pick locks like we do, no? Okay, that was number five, gave a click. And three. Okay, that was number four, a very distinctive click, finally something really... That was number two, give a click, and open. Phew. Okay, managed. Not that bad for a no-name or at least deleted name log for a hotel safe, not bad. I have to admit, I was, uh, because I was looking at the keyway and I was expecting something worse than that but well having picked it twice i would have to say i'm reasonably satisfied okay guys thanks for tuning in and i'll see you in the next video ciao hi guys a short addition to the video of the safe lock that's the safe basically this is how it looks like and here you can see this is the side where the tail piece goes in so I will show you how to operate it and I'll show you how it locks it. So you put the hole on the side, return it and that's it, the safe is locked. And for a little bit more blue, here we go, you can see that the tail piece here goes inside this hole, basically locking the safe in place. The only, my only concern about this type of technology is that probably this uh, rotating mechanism here is not that strong. So basically, if you pull strong, if you pull hard enough, it will probably break off. But that's only my assumption. Anyway, thanks for watching and yeah, keep it legal. Cheers.